we have made it way back onto the Loddon. Have to be a little bit quiet. Campers are getting up in the kayak. Just gonna be throwing around some swim baits. There's gotta be something up over in there. Come on. Damn, I hate when you snag it when in your casting zone. Worst. It's just the worst. Is. It's not really giving me any indication of what it wants to be. It's a nice little cod. And that's on a baby baby perch. He doesn't want to give up yet. Let's get you in the net, buddy. Coming around. Here we are. Oh, oh, oh. It's only just pinned. Yes, in the net. Look at that. What a beautiful fish. All right, I'll get this other rod untangled. All right, we've got a little cod on the troll. The baby perch only just pinned him. Only just. Uh, for a guzzler. I just mean a little fish and just getting taken down that. Beautiful little chunky cod. What a fatty. Nice. Alright, so we've got our first little cod for the day. And we're just going to let him go. Get him out of the net. All right. See you later, fella. Carp jump. It's not actually crazy deep through here either. Um, we've got 1.4 meters. That was even just a dip. It's going back up. So yeah, if I'm finding that this dive is not working too well, I might just put on two swing Mikey's. Got another. I think this one's a cod. It's not fighting crazy hard. There's another cod. On the baby perch again. Straight into the net, buddy. There you go. Not the biggest, again, though. Woo! Another cod on the troll, on the baby perch. Just another little youngin. All right, let's get the sock out of him. I'll just sit him there because what I like to do is get this other rod in before we get more of a mess. It's this uh, fishing rod holder, I ain't the best. <laughs> We're gonna be quick to grab that one. Oh, there goes all my water. Forgot to seal that up. I was thinking, why is my foot getting wet? If the sun comes out, I might be in trouble. I'm wondering how I do my photos in the kayak. This is how. Grab my bag, stick it there, and then I just stick my phone on a quick timer, like that. All right, time to release this little fella. Get him back in the water. 
All right. Say you later, fella. Well, this is going to be the end of the troll unless I decide to. Got one. Unless that's a big stick. Oh my gosh. Singing, how did that feel like that? Poor little yellow. Let's get out of that. Oh. Wow. Wow, we. I'm just sitting back in there for the moment. Well, there he goes. He's trying to go for a run. He's very good. Absolutely rare in the go. He is not happy. Wow. He is feisty. <laughs> Tiny little yellow. Alrighty then. See you later, fella. Oh. My line just snapped. Gotta get to my line before it disappears under the water. That was odd. <clears throat> Must have been a weak spot in the line. Alright. Bit annoying. We got one. Oh, that one feels a bit bigger than the last. The line all hooked up. Just watching my other line. Hopefully it's not going somewhere. It's definitely a cod the way it's fighting. Look at that. Beautiful cod. Oh, he is going for a big run. A little bit bigger than the last. It's got some power, this one. All right, we're gonna to try to get him into this this net. Then we'll sort out that other rod. And it's the little baby perch again. It's on fire today. All right, we've got him in the net. He's a bit cramped. But we'll quickly get this up. So the lure before we get it wrapped around the trolling motor. Okay. Baby perch again, you see that fella in there? I don't know, we'll measure that one. We haven't measured the last few. But what I wanna do is just wanna be a bit safe here because he's a bigger, and kayaks, two rods, you know, not enough room. Not enough room in here. Start by jamming that rod behind me. Get this rod in there. And my thumb's already ripped up. So we're going to go with the good old glove. All right, we've got a beautiful Murray cod in here. Let's get him out, take a look at him. There we go, look at that fella. Beautiful Murray cod. He is very chunky, very, very chunky. And if we lay him down to get a measure, his mouse here, and he's right up the very tip there. I'm gonna say, maybe 61 he's not the biggest but he weighs a lot he is very very chunky look at the size of the head on that all right we've had a real quick photo the one more time for the beautiful murray cod just going to release on this side maybe ah, we'll go down here here we go ready <clears throat> Let's get this big boy in the water. He'll let me know when he's ready. See you later, fella. So I think it's been a, overall a bit of a success of a relaxed fish. So I've been fishing quite a lot lately and walking banks. It's really just sort of taken it out of me. So I thought I want to fish, but let's just take it easy. Do a troll. The caster in me, Whew. 
There's a lot of logs around here. I've had to have a lot of restraint not to cast at them and stop the kayak every two seconds. Yeah, there could be big fish sitting on them, but I just need to just relax. I find it odd with the sounder. If I'm going, you know, around two kilometers an hour, it doesn't pick anything up. As soon as I increase to at least three or higher, it does okay. But if I stop completely, it still does okay, like it can find stuff. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. I wonder if somebody else knows what it, what it is. Let me know. There's a big fish back there. Nice, big and chunky. I'm just going to run over some structure here, so I'm going to expect a bit of a tug on the, the rods. I see there's some nice fish hanging around it. Nice fish, alright. <clears throat> Got one. Coming right across that log. It's definitely another cod. <clears throat> Not as big as the last. Unless it's just coming for me. Going for a run, for sure. I'm going to get the top quickly while this in. Now that was on the Aussie Crafted. Get it around this side. Wow. He's a lively one now. Wasn't too lively before. Wow. Come on. Only just pinned. <laughs> just wanted to grip this one, make it a bit quicker. In and out. Now this is the the funny thing. This um this lure, it's an Aussie crafted. I found it and it had the worst hooks on it, and I just left them on it. And it's losing all its paint. And I just think it's hilarious because People keep telling me change the hooks, and I keep telling them why. I keep catching fish with it. <laughs> Actually, we may have to change them now. Look, it's even snapped the barb. One of the barbs has been snapped. You're a beautiful, healthy looking one too. Aren't you good? Aren't you a good looking one? Oh, another beautiful Murray Cod. Let's get this one back into the drink. Ready? Come on. See you later, fella. All right, folks, let's wrap that one up. We finished fishing the Loddon, caught a few cod and a yellow. Had a great day, had a relaxing troll. Give my ankles a bit of a rest from walking the banks. If you like the content, throw me a subscribe. Another carp jumping over there. They've been everywhere this morning. Look at them go. Anyways. That's it for me. Catch you later. Oh no. Let's see what just happened then.